It says right here that on average, every American uses 178 gallons of water a day. 178 gallons of water a day. Can you believe that? Okay, class. Tonight's homework is to convert 178 gallons of water into liters. Then convert that into quarts. Can you believe Mr. Martin's science class? Each of us uses 178 gallons of water a day. Can you imagine what that looks like? Is this a gallon? No, that's almost a pint. There are like 16 of those in one gallon. That's a lot to drink. That water is not only used for drinking, that's water used for cooking, taking baths, showering, washing our clothes, watering our lawns, filling our swimming pools, and... And don't forget water used in agriculture, industry, and a whole lot more. Where can we get 178 gallons of water to see what that looks like? Hey, we just had that big recycling drive here at school. I'll put our paving containers over there. Let's do it! Isn't that amazing? I use so much water every day. Hey, don't worry. Over 78% of our Earth is covered with water, so there's plenty around. Not when you realize that most of our water is salt water from our oceans. Oh yeah, you're right. We can't use that. Don't forget the water keeps moving around the Earth through the water cycle. Yeah, I remember. That's really amazing. Evaporation, condensation, precipitation, evaporation, condensation, precipitation, evaporation, condensation, precipitation, evaporation. Okay, okay, we got it. What's going on here? Hi, Mr. Martin. We wanted to see what 178 gallons of water looked like, so we built this. Wow, that's very impressive. Good job. You've been very busy. I hope you've had time to do your homework. Okay, I converted 178 gallons into liters. That's 674 liters. Right, and I've got quarts. It's 712 carts. Good, we're done. Not quite. How about a little extra credit? I converted it into pints. 178 gallons is 1,424 pints. But wait, I also converted 178 gallons into cups. It's 2,848 cups. Isn't that 